It's beer and food o'clock on Real Ale Craft Beer, and today we've got a bar of Nida Stratos bubble chocolate. Look at that, even the cow, look at the cow smiling. Really happy there, the cow, to be producing really good chocolate like this. Uh, Bobla of Gelder, um, of course it, it's milk from the cow. Uh, I don't want to be attacked by vegans or... or um, I'm having a joke. Um, when I'm having a little break from beer, I've just come back from the Bergen Beer Festival 2018 and I'm having a little bit of a break from beer when I've drunk 40, 50, 60 beers over the weekend and my throat's a little bit coarse and I want to have a rest. Some of you guys ask what do I do when I'm, when I'm having a break from beer, when I'm not drinking beer. I'll often have one or two days a week where I don't drink and, and this is an off night so I thought to myself the good people at Elijahfield and Microbrewery, thank you very much to Elijahfield and Microbrewery, sent me home with four bars of wonderful wonderful chocolate and I thought night off, I'm never going to get this chocolate again, let's give it a review. So here's a look at the chocolate. You've probably seen chocolate like this before, where have I seen chocolate? It looks a little bit like an aero bar. There's the end, there's the filling. Lovely bubbliness going on. Quite light as well, it's 150 grams of chocolate. Nida, I've had some of their, their Nida smash is really good. It's like twizzly bits of chocolate with salt in it. But let's get into this. Chocolate goodness and oh my goodness me. It's a touch chalky to begin with, but then when that chalkiness dissipates, goes away, moves on to the next stage, it's just all creamy and lovely and chocolatey. Look, it's got to the stage now where my fingerprints are in the chocolate. It's starting to melt on me. That chocolate is really delicious. Sticky and thick and gloopy, just how you just how you want chocolate to be. How does it compare to the big American brands, the big British brands? Well, it used to be a big British brand, but now I think it's owned by Kraft. Kraft. So it's technically American. How does it line up against the big American brands of chocolate? Very, very well. What I find with the American brands of chocolate are uh, if you eat. You know the purple bars, you know what I'm talking about, the purple brand of chocolate. I can eat three or four squares of that and then I'm like, well, oh, I'm, really, I'm really sick of this, I'm really kind of sickly of this, I can't carry on, I want to carry on, I'm still hungry, but you know, that kind of weird tingly sensation in the mouth. I got a funny feeling that like, I could eat half a bar of that, this Nida Stratos. It's light, it's bubbly, it's lovely. Yeah, I could, eat, I could eat half the bar. And for me, that's a good sign. I'm happy, the cow's happy, and they even want to send me some more in the post. Look at that. <laughs> right, rating for Nida Stratos bubble bar. I think it's a cracking bar of chocolate. I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10. It's a 7 out of 10 from Milo Craft Beer. This is what I do when I'm not drinking beer. Um, I like to... I am dipping my fingers slowly but surely into the world of food. Some of you might have noticed, um, I've been doing some pizzas, I've been doing some chilies. What else have I been doing? Lots of crisps. Guinness crisps, Guinness sausages this summer. And it's something I enjoy to do. Um, it's something which, which it seems to do quite well on the channel as well. Uh, I might get four to five hundred views on a beer review. I'll smack a thousand, thousand views on food. Um, so I suppose you guys are, are voting with your eyeballs, aren't you? You're, you're, you're watching a lot more of the food stuff than you are the beer. It doesn't mean I'm going to move away completely from beer. I'm still pumping out 14 beers a week on YouTube. Um, when I told the good people at YouTube that and my fellow Welsh creators when we got a, a get together the other day, they couldn't believe it. You can believe I'm uploading 14 videos a week, that's two a day. Um, 
are you mad, they said. But yeah, that's that's our timetable, that's what we do. So lots and lots of beer, but also gonna be a little bit of food edging its way in too. So Night Out Stratos, seven out of 10. Please put your comments in the comments box. Let me know what you think of, pardon me, if you've tried this chocolate, or let me know your comments in the comments box on where you think the channel is headed. I appreciate all your comments, I appreciate all your feedback, but thanks for watching. Put your comments in the comments box. Please subscribe to our daily peer reviews. Give us a big fat thumbs up. Boom! And cheers.